What's up, everybody? It's your boy, the Aussie Coco. This is Green Leaf. And right now, I had to catch up to watch the show. Once I wa once I got into the show, I liked it. It was good. And now I caught the season five. Now, this got through watching season five, episode one. And it called the first day. So, pretty much for all this show been through, this show came out 2016, and now it's 20, you know, now we call it the 2020. I watched all the season. This is their fifth season, by the way. So, I enjoyed the show. And not much to tell, but it's good where it was. You got them losing the church, and they, you know, pretty much we know that Phil is still in love. He's, he, uh, I don't know if we can trust the guy, you know, everything been going on. You got, uh, Sophia, I don't know what's going on with her. We know that she lost, you know, she can't have kids and stuff. She's been through a lot. We know so I've been through a lot when she was being abused and manipulated and raped and stuff like that. I would say abuse. She finally left that alone. But Nikki, I don't know. What she was trying to do, because it looked like she was trying to kiss Zora and my respect it. But then we got to season. Then, you know, I'm just going around. The, I'm just circling around the show that I'm into. So, yeah, I'm going to continue to review episode. Next episode for next week, I'll be doing episode two. So, um, we know that uh, James and uh, May, they're getting me married. I guess they now say got a divorce. They got a good vo a divorce because remember that she slept with Rhino, Rhino and he slept with um May's sister. I forgot her name. We didn't see her no more after that because she was on season one to the next season. We know Matt is um, a child molester. He also got murdered by Grace, but it was self defense because he was trying to kill her and. They see no seat and not care her for self defense, and they was gonna take her, turn her. She was gonna go to prison. Don't know why they were trying to make it seem like she's a murderer, but she wasn't. It was self defense. And what different is we find that she had a, a son named M. No A J. We thought he's the one that was robbing the store, but he wasn't there. Maybe he was home. I'm still wondering where was he. We found out that he was innocent all along, and Sophia already think he's guilty because he found all those pills in his back, in his bag, and she trying to get him to turn himself again. He was gonna turn himself in, and next thing you know, the the investigation been closed, so he's free to go. He don't have to go to jail no more. And when Grace was looking for him, he was in the bathroom and he switched his wrist. Now I don't know if he's dead or alive because that's how they left the episode. And to that knowledge, I'm gonna continue. Like I said, I'm gonna continue to do this the next episode for Green Leaf. That's all I have to say about this show. I enjoyed it, I liked it, and I'm gonna continue to watch it. Caught up, man. I will have to catch up. But yeah, guys, that's all I have to say. Make sure you wait, comment, subscribe, please turn on the notification, share this video, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Peace out.